Hey everyone, it's Dr. Kashaba here at Natural Endocrinology Specialist, and today I want to spend a few minutes going over a really important topic. It's called insulin resistance. So insulin resistance is a condition in which your body produces the hormone insulin, normal levels, but the cells and the receptors are resistant to that hormone. Eventually, with time, many, maybe a few years, maybe a decade, somebody could be at risk for developing prediabetes. And then again, with more time, as the condition exacerbates, it becomes type 2 diabetes. And so today, I wanted to see if you are even at risk for prediabetes by learning about a calculation. It's called the HOMA IR score. It stands for Homeostatic Model Assessment of Insulin Resistance. And today, I have a quick video to show you how to calculate your insulin resistance score and see if you're at risk. So what you can do is just open up your browser and then you can come to our website, nesaz.com. And up at the top under services tab, you will look for the metabolic health tab. So right away, you can access it by clicking on this button, calculate my home IR score, or you can scroll down on this page and you will find the calculator. So in this calculator, you only need two numbers. You need a fasting insulin and a fasting glucose, and they both need to be done from the same blood draw. That means you can't have had an insulin done now and a fasting glucose from three months ago. So it's more accurate when they're drawn on the same blood draw, same day, same time. So what I want you to notice over here is that a normal fasting insulin, the range can be between 4 and 25. And that's a typical reference range on most labs. And optimal is actually, we say, around under 10. Fasting glucose, normal is 70 to 99. And optimal is 70 to 85. And so this is where it can be confusing. You could have a normal fasting insulin level and a normal fasting glucose level, but you have no idea that you're actually insulin resistant. So let me show you this. So I'm going to choose a number between 4 and 25 in the reference range and we kind of go out in the middle somewhere around 15 and then I'm going to take a value and again normal is 70 to 99 I'm going to choose something you know in the 90s I'll just go over 90 so if you see I have a HOMA IR score of 3.3 so this means I'm at high risk what I'm looking for ultimately for a normal HOMA IR score and a normal one is around 0.5 to 1.4 once you start exceeding that you start to get into a moderate moderate sign of insulin resistance. And anything definitely over three is a sign that you have some significant insulin resistance. So that's where we would like to work with you and identify what are your obstacles and reasons for insulin resistance. And then we can get into more lifestyle suggestions and see if there's anything in your diet, your sleep, your stress level, your exercise activity, and you try to tackle it that way because generally it can respond a lot to lifestyle interventions. And if there's some supplementation that you need, and we do a lot of analysis through blood work. We check your other hormones and see what's happening in your system. So we like to get it all balanced out. So if you want to take action and you have a high insulin HOMA IR score, we would be super happy to help you out. You can click on the book now and you can schedule your appointment today with either Dr. Holyoke or, or myself, Dr. Krishaba. Thanks for watching this and I hope you have a blessed day. Thank you.